I tell you what lads, what we witnessed last night was corruption unfolding before our eyes at the very highest level. In case you missed it, host Qatar beat Jordan 3-1 in the AFC Asian Cup final courtesy of three dodgy penalties, which were all converted by forward Akram a fifth. Now, I'm not one for conspiracy theories, but those who watched the tournament kept telling me to make a video about how Qatar were cheating their way to the final. In fact, I owe an apology to one of my subscribers, Zach Horrocks. When he initially claimed that everything was rigged, I thought it was baseless. However, his prediction turned out to be spot on. So fair play to you if you're watching this bro. While match stats don't necessarily tell the full story, believe me when I say this, Jordan were the better side throughout the contest. They had more possession, twice as many goal attempts, and could quite easily have bagged three or four on another night. Obviously, dominating a final doesn't give you a divine right to lift the trophy, just as Bayern Munich. But when VR is constantly intervening in favor of one team, you don't really stand a chance either way. Just look at the comment section of the highlights from the game. It's gotten almost 2 million views, yet each and every person is banging on about how Jordan were robbed, and rightly so. I've never seen such shameless cheating take place, and this should be sending alarm bells ringing throughout the footballing world. Not only would Jordan, who are unlikely to ever get this far in a major tournament again, robbed after showcasing spirit, fight and determination that even Premier League level players couldn't keep up with, but Qatar's influence on the sport got just that bit deeper. It's bad enough that billionaires are ruining things off the pitch, but it appears they're adamant to fuck shit up on it too. Every man and their dog know that Qatar were awarded the World Cup because of underhand payments made to FIFA, but it's one thing doing that to host a competition, and a whole nother to make sure they win it. It's quite pathetic that everyone just sat around and watched as they all the entire footballing calendar 14 months ago to play out a summer tournament in the winter, but for me, this result was even worse. I don't have much else to add really, but I wanted to do my bit to raise awareness of the situation at hand and give Jordan the credit they deserve for their monumental effort. Do let me know your own thoughts on this down below, and I'll catch you in the next one folks. Peace.